Hello, Stellar Nation. Hope you're having a fantastic, fantastic Thursday. It is the Stellar Universe returning back for another live stream. Hope you guys are doing fantastic. Akuna Matata today. Akuna Matata. It means no worries. Because uh, I think that's going to be the theme of today's live stream when it comes to Life is Strange 2. Um, in the world we are about to embark on. Uh, but uh, it is still August, which means in August, we are still doing the Back to School campaign, BTS Power Up, raising funds for amazing teachers all around the country. And um, man, was it a crazy day yesterday <laughs> um, where we were able to get over $750 um total so far for the month of august and we are getting closer and closer to hitting one thousand dollars how can you help very easy very simple all you have to do hit that subscribe button and then uh because simply hitting that subscribe button adds money to the to, to the pot and hitting the like button during the live streams we have all august long that adds money to the pot as well what else can you do? Engage in the chat. Yesterday's engagement uh, with Photon's recommendation to play Stardew Valley and then helping with the math um, helped in a big way. And everybody else cheering on and watching me make a fool of myself. That all, believe it or not, helps raise funds to, uh, to, to these amazing teachers. And uh, another way, sharing the hashtag BTS Power Up on Twitter, on Facebook, on all social media. Uh, sure, Snapchat, you can uh, dance to it on um, TikTok, whatever it is, sharing it um, and getting the word out, getting people to come on board. We are eight people away from last that I checked from breaking 300 subscribers, which would be amazing to do in the month of August. And then sharing levels for Super Mario Maker 2, because when you share them, with the hashtag BTS Power Up on Twitter or even in the live stream, I will play those levels. And uh, with each one we beat, we raise more money. So that is how you can help. First on the board today, welcome to Yamad. Mr. Cracker Parrot finally returns. Welcome aboard, Mr. Cracker Parrot. Photon Gaming, hello, hello. To you and Alex 2.2, I see you in the house as well, so welcome to you. Um, it is a good group we have here. Guess what? You probably already know from the title of the live stream, from the trailer we watched yesterday, uh, and from the thumbnail. We are back again. Oh, dang it. Uh, yes, back again with Life is Strange 2. Episode 4 came out today. I was downloading it, and it finally downloaded, and then I hit a live stream. So that is why it took a little longer. But the game has been downloaded. We are ready to play it. But before we play, we have a pop quiz. A new apple enters the pop quiz realm. Can you guess what this apple is? It is a beautiful raid gradient colored apple you see it's like dark red then it kind of does this gradient fade in fade out i don't know what's up with youtube and not popping up notifications but that's not cool but here's this beautiful new apple again this is not a repeat apple i don't think i've repeated an apple yet i could be wrong but I've got new apples every time we do the live stream in August so far. And this is a new, brand new one. Uh, it is a good size. It's bigger than yesterday's Fuji Fiji apple. Uh, it is still not as big as the Honeycrisp that we've had before. Uh, it's about the same size as the, en um, not the Ambrosia, but the one that you guys haven't guessed yet, which I was about to spoil. <laughs> uh, I still have that apple in my fridge, the one that you guys have not guessed yet. But uh, this one is another common one. 
I see this around a lot, so it's not a should not be a hard one. Um, so, but I'm gonna try it. I don't know if I've ever had this apple before, but I'm gonna try it and let you know what it tastes like. Okay. This one is tart. That's why the face that I'm making. It's not as tart as a Granny Smith apple. But it's definitely got a, a tartness to it. It's not... I have had a Granny Smith apple. That was the very, very tart episode. You guys probably... If, you've, if you were there for that episode, I was making all kinds of faces eating that apple. But I did do a Granny Smith apple. This one... I would put tartness right below Granny Smith. I don't think I've had a tart one since the Granny Smith or at all other than the Granny Smith. Yep. Definitely got tartness to it. More tart than sweet. Not an Empire apple, but good guess. Yeah, this one's definitely more tart and sweet. Um, I'll let you guys guess a few. And then um, if you guys need a clue, I'll give you a clue. It's a tasty apple, but it does have a tartness to it that makes me do funny faces. Uh, so I don't know if it would be a go-to apple like my other ones, but... All right, man, I'm just chewing away. All right, I'm not gonna waste any more of your time. We need to jump back into it. To the live stream we go. Look at that, it is Life is Strange too. It looks so good, ready to play. Let's pick up where we last left off. And run with it. Now we've already had a gala apple. And we have not had a golden delicious, but this is not a golden delicious. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They lived in peace until hunters took their dad away. We're doing a recap of everything that we've played through. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. They discovered a secret hideout where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick, and they had to move on. The brothers made it to the home of their ancestors, and the old wolves took care of them. Unfortunately, the hunters were hot on their trail and found them. The brothers had nowhere to stay again, so they decided to keep going south. They soon entered the old forest of the giants, where they met a pack of stray dogs who worked in a secret farm. The brothers joined them and worked hard to stock up on gold for their future. They were happy to find others like them and everybody loved the little wolf who was growing up fast. His power was growing too. The little wolf was more and more confident and independent.
The big brother hooked up with a cool she dog. They had their own adventures. Suddenly, the mean farmers who owned the land tried to hurt the brothers. Oh man. The little cub was injured. He transformed into a super wolf and destroyed everything. The big brother was badly wounded. And worse, we didn't know where the little cub was. Oh boy, here we go. not a jazz apple but this is uh, my clue would be one lovely lady of an apple that's my clue This is back when we were, before we left on the train. Hey, Sean. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. It was a bad idea. Daniel. No way. It's all good. I wish I listened when you tried to stop me from going with Finn. I was too pissed. <sighs> it's okay, dude. You're my brother, and that's all that counts. So, why don't you come and get me? I'm alone, Sean. I don't know what to do. Oh, this is a dream sequence. I'm scared. Don't get so close to that edge. Please, come and get me. Yes, I, I swear. Oh, he's gonna fall back. Stop. Mr. Cracker Parrot, and yes, Alex 2.2, I think you we were on the right track too. It is a pink lady apple. So be sure to use pink lady hash and hashtag it BTS power up for a chance to be entered in a drawing for a prize we give away at the end of the month. So, fuck, Daniel. I keep having these nightmares since I came out of the coma. All right, so. <clears throat> We've got a sketchbook. I can do a sketch, sure. Ugh, can't even focus on the page. This sucks ass, man. Oh boy. Oh, I have to look up. What am I drawing now? Oh, this. It's so hard to focus. Gotta practice way more. 
not giving up. All right, let's not give up. Let's I keep going. Okay start. Here we go. But I can keep going. Let's keep drawing. Well, I don't want to draw prison bars. Draw a staircase. Junior Oreto, hello, welcome to the live stream. Almost done sketching. Yep. All right. We got some sketching done and helped Mod catch up. This must be my punishment. Uh, leftovers. Okay. Let's see. A bouncing ball. Zero depth perception. Goodbye, sports. Oh, I don't want to use the call button right now. What is this? Yeah. Thanks for the card, Agent. U.S. Department Can't of Justice, Maria Flores. You. Call in time, day or night, if you wanted to talk. Okay. Let's see. What is this? What is this? Ooh, Cat. Cassidy's letter. I miss Cass so much. Wish I could hold her. All right, let's read this letter. No, I want to read the letter. Oh, the tattoo we got. That's right, we did get the tattoo. We did not fool around with her, though. She was not happy. Can we read it? There we go. Howdy, city boy. I bet you're surprised to hear from me. I found out we were in the same hospital from the police after we were questioned when I was checking out a month ago. When I checked out a month ago, okay. So I took the chance to write and hope you get this. Wish I uh, could say everything I want, but you never know who's reading, right? If anybody else is reading this, but beep beep, <laughs> F you. I truly hope you are okay after what happened. As for me, I don't remember much except the explosion at Merrill's office. Then I woke up in the hospital with blunt trauma and that, and what the doctors call blast lung injury. Just glad that I can still play guitar and sing, not that I feel like it. You learn a, a load about medicine stuck in a hospital bed, as I'm sure you know, my sweet compadre. Oh, I'm, as I'm sure you know, my sweet compadre. Still working on that Espanol. Miss my lessons and my teacher. Oh, you probably know more about uh, what's going on than me, but Hannah, Penny, and I were released without charges. The police were stoked to bust a farm of drugs traffickers rather than us gutter punks toiling in the field. We asked about you and Daniel, but got no answers. Surprise. So with Finn and you gone, our, uh, our rail family is kind of broken up. Now uh, we're just a lonely trio. Tra uh, train hopping up and down the state, but it feels like we're going in a loop to nowhere. Hannah and Penny aren't the same, and we fight too much. I'm not even sure we'll be together for much longer, so... Things change, right? Maybe I'll have a whole new set of blues songs for the road. I know you're, gonna, you're going to, to trial soon over... Oh, we're going to trial soon? What?! I know you're going to trial soon over the Seattle situation and you will get the justice and freedom you deserve. You and Daniel are amazing brothers and hope you find a way home soon. I hope we can swim naked again under a new moonlight. It's a big world and maybe we'll meet again someday. I'll always be singing your song. Love and peace, Cassidy. Well, that's sweet. What is it? Oh, 
All right, Sean, we are grateful to find out that you are safe and awake. So this is from the grandparents. The police contacted us when you were found unconscious in Humboldt County. We were allowed to visit you in the hospital, but we want you to recover ASAP. But doctors say that you woke up from that coma stronger than before. Whoa, stronger than before. Whoa. Did we, did we, did, did a little of the powers brush up on us? The wolf pack is going to have two superheroes in it? I don't know. I'm just reading into it. The most important thing now is to find Daniel. We are hoping the police, we are helping the police any way we can. They really want to help find him too, Sean. Hopefully this reflects well during your trial. Oh dear. Yep, we're definitely going to trial. We know this must be hard for you after everything you and your brother have been through. Are we about to break, we're going to break out of the hospital. That's what's going to happen. You're both in our thoughts and prayers every day and night. Remember, you are family and we love you. We hope to visit you in Jolina Shore as soon as we can. P.S. Chris insists to write a little note. It's attached to the letter. He doesn't know Daniel is missing. Oh. Don't know if we'll ever come back, guys. Hmm. Nice to have that superhero. Hi, Sean and Daniel. I hope you are okay. Oh, yeah, Captain Spirits. Okay. I'm fine, but I miss both of you a lot. When are you coming back? Dad has been better lately. That's good. He says hello, and we're fishing now. The summer is here. We do a lot of stuff outside. All the snow is gone. Okay, so we've passed the winter season. You should come back to see uh, Beaver Creek without the snow. I'll be waiting for you. Okay. That's good stories. What is this? Look at the TV. Stupid reality shows. All right. So TV is not for us. Nothing else to do. Let's hit the call button. Is anybody coming? Do I have to push it again? Nope. This day feels like every other day. Can I move out of my bed? Nope. I don't know what else I could do. Oh wait, I hear someone. <laughs> Good day, sunshine. Hey, Joey. Joey! I don't know Joey. Hey man. That looks like it might have been food. Hard to tell. Ha ha. Never heard that before. Oh, somebody is in a bad mood. Sorry, Joey. Not feeling it today. Mm. I don't blame you. But maybe I got something to cheer you up. Pecans and chocolate? Uh oh. There's that smile. Thanks, Joey. So how you feeling today? Any headaches? Socket pain? No. It's all good. But this is your final test before you need for a check you out. Check me out to Juvie. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, we're going to Juvie. Oh wait, I gotta follow the light. Okay. Come on, Sean. You've been there before. Straining too hard? Nope. Headache? <sighs> nah. I just. I actually have to move this can't around. Focus today. Sorry. Remember, to see objects on your left side, you gotta turn your head more now. You're way off today. Now try to align your pen with mine. I'll try. No rush. This is tough. A lock. You're 
depth perception will always be affected. Oh, so I have to move. Oh, shit. Oh, this thing is hard. Hey. Hey, we got job. it. Okay. Let's do it again. Yeah, I know. It's hard. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Yeah, that's enough. Too much stress on you and your eye. But remember, your depth perception will always be affected. Mm. Here, read this. Patient cleared. <laughs> I'm using a mouse. I am using a mouse. Uh, patient cleared. Okay. Get me out of here. Please, Joe. Sean, I want to help you, but that's not my job. You can try, but you can't rig the exam, Sean. <sighs> it's time we release you. Sorry. Your vision has improved a lot. Now, you don't really have severe side effects anymore. Yeah. That's just great. I do have to tell them the truth. But first, let's clean this dress. Hey, sure hope you're watching the door like your phone. Oh, come on. <sighs> you ain't going nowhere. Great. All I do is watch them. Yes, true. Your job. Do you mind if we talk alone? Mind if I finish with my patient? He looks good for now, right? Just You're not the doctor or the nurse. Come on now. Let the sure. man do his job. I'll swing by later, Sean. Stay cool. Oh boy. So, how are you feeling today, Mr. Diaz? Amazing. Did you find Daniel? I want to go over this again. What? I've been telling the same fucking story for three weeks. How much longer? Until it makes sense. Until you get it right. So, silence isn't gonna help you now. Listen close, Sean. Tomorrow you're going to Jolina Shore and you'll be arraigned in court. For the murder of a Seattle police officer. You might spend the rest of your life in prison. Or you can talk to me. I'm innocent until proven guilty. Right? And I believe that. That's why I want you to tell me the whole truth. It's just... I can't. Was Daniel involved? Is that why you can't talk? No, no way. And you're absolutely sure your dad didn't go after the officer? Yeah, he came outside. Then he was killed. That's what he did. Just guilty of being, who knows? I hear you, but you sure you didn't get upset and go after the officer? It yeah, happens. I'm sure. Jesus. It doesn't happen all the time. Look at me. Okay, let's just jump ahead. Tell me what happened in that farm in Humboldt. The place looks like a tornado wiped it out. I've told you so many times. I have no clue why the place was trashed. I passed out. Plus two seriously wounded along with you. And a missing child. The only statement we have is yours. Sean, throw me a bone here. Can't you see I want to help? So you haven't found my brother? We might have some leads. You can help by telling me the truth. Okay. You... Fuck. The robbery. Whose idea was it? His or yours? Huh? Nope, it was definitely Finn's. Finn, it was his idea to rip off Marrow. Did he force you to help? 
or did you go along with it? Oh, dang it, I have to... We decided to go along with it, didn't we? I think we went along with it. Yeah, we went along with it. Yes, I went along. I had to get money for Daniel. No choice. I swear. Swear. I didn't think anything like this was going to happen. Nobody does, Sean. Until it's too late. Yeah. Now I know. Your friend is learning the hard way. Uh, they didn't deserve it. Didn't want this. They didn't deserve it. We all make mistakes. Yeah. Well, some mistakes are worse than others. By the way, we contacted your grandparents in Beaver Creek. They can visit you after you're transferred. Might be a while, but you do have a support group. We couldn't track down your mother, though. Sorry. Good. What about Daniel? You said you had leads. I said might. Uh, hold on. I gotta take this call. You know, when I made that decision to say that Finn... Because it was Finn. Let's be clear. It was definitely Finn who did this. I'll move the camera around. Okay. Like, he... That's just karma for dragging Dano into this shit. Yeah, because it was definitely him. And we we did go along with it. I remember that was a decision we made to go along with it. At least Cassidy wasn't at Merrill's when it blew up. Wait, I thought she was. No. She got upset and mad and left. That's right, because we, we played with both endings. The initial ending that we went with, we went along with Finn's plan. She got mad at us and left, so she avoided being hurt severely. Then when we opened the second file and played around with it for her, just to see the alternate ending, uh, when we didn't go along with it, she stayed with us and, and lost her life. So that's right, she ran off. Sorry about that. Okay. So what's going on with Daniel? You really have leads? Yes, we do. That's our job. The Bureau put his profile out over four states. So we are on the case. Uh, you lied to me. Yep. You lied to me. You have no leads. You have no fucking idea where my brother is. I don't lie, Sean. But you did. And your brother is paying the price. Fuck. You. I'm done. Anyway. Thanks for talking to me. I'll be back tomorrow to take you to Jolina Shore. Look out. I have to guard the guard now. <laughs> Love it. Sit down so we can get this show going. So, how did your interview with Scully go? Haha, <laughs> Scully. You mean interrogation? Who knows? Maybe Detective Flores wants to help. Maybe not. I just can't trust her. After what you and your brother went through, I don't blame you. Oh, this shit is all wrong, man. You've been out of the garden for three weeks now. We talked every day. I can see that you're a good person. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, I'm a good person. But I'm not. I've done too many mistakes. I let everybody down. I lost Daniel. And I'm going to trade. This is all bullshit. Now let's check this out. Oh, are we going to see it? The healing is coming along nice. Oh, they blurred it. Clean for the next week or so. Seven. It's great. Seemed to shrink this morning. What did she say? Nothing I want to hear. This will take time. Maria and Sean. You have to process those. Ugh. I can tell myself that shit. Clearly, I'm no therapist, but I've nursed patients with your injury. They all turned their anger into energy. You will too. <laughs> Plus, the glass eye tech is pretty cool now. <laughs> Things change, huh? Uh so positive. There we go. I'm trying to be positive. But it's so hard. I know. <laughs> I do. But I promise there's a treat coming your way. Now as for your wound, this is the last time you hear this from me. You have to clean it with sterile gauze and saline solution. He's, it's a good nurse. Doing a good job. Then wrap it up with clean dressing. You're the shit. Remember, you gotta do this. Four times a day. Four times a day? Sounds about right. I'm sorry about everything, Sean. I wish I could have done more. Dude, you saved my ass. You're the only one I trust. It really helped. Cool. Glad when I can make a change. Oh shit! Emergency. I'm out. And no so smoke break. Let's say our goodbye tomorrow. Oh, Sean, check out that towel. Got your name all over it. Oh, what do you have for me? Catch you later. And then him saying, "Let's say goodbye tomorrow," worries me that we may not get to see each other tomorrow. All right, let's go check out that towel. What? Wow. Whoa. I haven't seen you in a long time. Can we check out the sketchbook? What is this? Had a few beers. Daniel's asleep. Same night every night. He wants to train more, but we don't have time. We gotta hide. It's not easy. I borrowed a blanket and a few other things from your tent. We'll give them back to you when you come looking for your Super Wolf comic. It's waiting for you, Jake. Wait, what? I 
Agent 420, Cassidy, Wild. Okay. Oh yeah, I remember drawing that. Two story. Oh, and me. Okay. That was all of us at the fire. I remember sketching this. What is this, a three-eyed cat? Depression night, everyone shared their worst memory, everyone felt like crap. What a wonderful world, went to bed early again with Daniel, kinda wish I could have stayed like everyone else. Oh, stayed like everyone else. Oh. Got it. Uh, what is this? It's like half man, half wolf drawings. What are these? I'm a swear wolf. Daniel messed up again. Gotta fix this. So effing tired of running away. Okay. I guess we're we're done. How do I what do I do? How do I go back? Is there something I'm missing? It won't let me go back. I do here? Oh, I can't read anything there. Why can't I go back? Oh, wait. Oh. I gotta get to him. Find a way to escape. Nope, oh, I knew it. I knew it. Oh. Okay. Time to clear off now. This whole hospital is so quiet. So don't make any noise. I'll find a way to get the hell out of here. Oh boy. Okay. Not gonna push the call button. Look under this. Nada. Nothing. Joey's pen. She's the only one who helped me get through this shit. Let's take the pen then. Nothing around here. Let's see. There must be. A yeah. Thanks for the card, Agent. Can't wait to text you. There's bed sheets. Maybe I could. Uh, Are we gonna create a rope? A decoy Sean in the bed. Oh, we're gonna make a decoy Sean in the bed. All right, so we've got the decoy. We got curtains. What else do we have? A window. Wish I could just walk out. They've been working on these rooms forever. It's my backpack has got to be somewhere around here. So I need to go get my stuff from there. Oh, there's a guard. 
Sweet dreams, my friend. Maybe I can trick him. Say I need an aspirin or something. Well, not yet. I don't want to start the ball rolling. Let's see. What do we have here? Emergency plan. Let's take a look at it. We are there. Just gotta get past that locked door. And an angry guard. So I need to go to the staff room, get my backpack, and then I need to head back. That that's the that's the exit. There are a few emergency exits. Two of them down, and then one far out. Okay, got it. Got it. All right. So let's see if there's anything else. Nothing in the bathroom. Is there no light switch? There it is. All right. Okay. Check the eyes. Oh, I get to look at it? Kind of? Kind of? The game doesn't want to show it to me. All right, let's check. This one isn't screwed in. Tear it off then. Let's do it. Oh wait, I have to tear it off? Oh, I gotta keep tapping away, come on. There we go. Hey, what the hell are you doing in there? Where did I hide it? Nice job, Sean. Now the guard is awake and pissed off. It's all right. We're going to ask for medicine later, right? Anything else we can deal with? Nothing, nothing. We'll keep the light on. Maybe I could get Joey to help me. Would he get busted? He'd probably get busted. Should I push the call button? I don't know if I... Joey could probably distract the guard dog. I don't know if I want to get him in trouble, though. Let's make the fake body. I don't want to get Joey in trouble. <sighs> that looks so fake. But it might work for a second. All right. There's nothing. Oh, there's a window. Oh. Need a superhero to open that shit. Hope my last view of this world isn't this window. Oh, I get to look outside. Okay, there's a car. One stupid car. And I'm out of here. I have to go to that car. Oh, reception desk. Tonight. Works for me. Oh, what is this? Oh, scaffolding. Slip into one of those rooms under construction. Yeah, we can go into a construction room and go down. Okay. Not a bad plan. Um, the curtain will close. Can I have some privacy, please? I don't know why I did that, but okay. Oh, I can ambush the guard? How am I going to ambush the guard? The windows are secured. Let me just ask for medicine. Sir? Hello? Okay. What's wrong now? Head hurts. I need aspirin. That's a sad story. But I'm not a pharmacy, kid. Oh. So I'm going to have to... Trick him into coming in here and then... Knock him out? Okay... 
Do I need anything else in this room before I knock him out? No? Here we go. Hey, hello? I need help. Please. What? What's the matter, kid? Huh? My head. It's killing me. I need help. Hold on. Oh, boy. You're gonna need help if you're fucking with me. Oh boy. Where's my bag? <laughs> Sorry, a little too late. I hope oh, there's my stuff. Some gauze, construction room. We're going to go down the scaffolding. Um, should I wake up Finn or escape? Oh my gosh, these decisions are already heavy as is. Um, I'm just going to escape. I don't need him to know my business. All the decisions I've made have only highlighted the big wolf, and that's concerning for me. Come on, what are we doing? Stealing a car isn't going to help my case either. And we already know how to hotwire a car, so... Oh boy. Yeah, Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> it's not going to matter that we <laughs> knocked out a security guard now. Oh my goodness. Do we make the title screen yet? A security guard sleeping on the job. I don't know. I wouldn't. I don't think he's elevated to the level of cop. But still, you should not have done that. But I wasn't gonna get Joey involved, and I couldn't find any other options. Like, where do we start our search for Daniel? No, I didn't call, I didn't block the music. So, I'm sure I'll, I'll get a copyright claim on this. Mm. 
but I'm not making any money off of these, so <laughs> it's not going to affect me, I guess. Life is strange to Faith. Oh, that's the name. That's the title of the episode, Faith. Well, there's music, yeah, in the background. I don't know what it is, though. It's not a song, it's just music. Welcome to Nevada. Oh, we're in Nevada. Oh, I guess we ran out of gas. Oh, or are we just planning our trip? At some point, we're going to run out of gas, and we have no money to get more gas. Yay, Mr. Cracker Parrot. Yes. Come and hang out. We did make it to the title screen, though, so that's exciting. Do I do anything? Nope. Nope. Where did I find a cigarette and lighter? Oh, my, in my backpack. Never mind. Takes place. Uh, Life is Strange One takes place in Arcadia Bay. I think that's like up north in Washington or Seattle area. Yes, this is my room for the night. Oh, we get to sleep. Let's check out the fuel gauge. Yep, that's what I thought. Uh, cigarette pack. Oh, it's a smoker's car. That's how we got all this stuff. Got it. Agents floors this car. Oh, for a second there, I thought I stole her car, but I was like, what is she doing so late? Take the card. Uh, owner stuff. Let's look at it. Oh, we stole a family of four's car. Oh, what did we do? Must do list May 8th. Drop off kids. Hospital checkup. 2 p.m. Miss Scott's x rays and blood tests. Pick up kids. Night shift. Oh, we, this is a nurse. Oh, no. We stole a nurse's stuff? at the map in a second. Let's see what's in the backpack. No, not this. My so backpack. Car, guys. Oh, wait. I don't want to do my gauze now. Oh, 
Um, well, let's check the map first before I clean my eye. Okay. I don't. Arcadia Bay in general is not real, but I look at the map here. We're looking at California, so California is real, obviously. So I think the make-believe Arcadia Bay was somewhere north where Seattle and Washington is, and we were going to head down south to Mexico. But um, now we're on our way to Nevada to go to that point. Anything else in the car? Ooh, if there's something up here, switch light on. Light is off. Okay. Nothing else, nothing else, nothing else. Let's turn the light back on. Shit. What? I don't know how long I've been on the road. I don't either. Let's clean our eye out. All right. Careful. We get to see the eye yet? Nope. Still no eyes. I should have listened to Joey. This is a mess. Okay. So we clean the eye. We look through the owner's stuff. We checked out the map. Okay. Haven Point is straight ahead. Just a few more hours drive. All right. So we're going to do the wires. Yes. Plotus can now add Grand Theft Auto to my file. Well, in assaulting a guard. Can we start yet? Light off. Are we going to fall asleep? Oh, we lost the eye. We don't have an eye anymore <laughs> because of the explosion. Out of this century. Oh wait! Oh, he's daydreaming. With me, Sean. <laughs> yeah. Just zoning out. Just don't do that when you're driving, my son. So. Uh, hey, his dad made a. a new car. I know it's not a new board, but it's got Ford Hot Wheels. Thanks for finishing it, Dad. A perfect reward for your excellent report card. I'm proud, Sean. That makes up for when you bullshit me about needing cash. Oh, yeah. I'll try to be cool. No dad jokes, huh? I hope you're not too bummed out to go on a big road trip with your lovely papito, huh? <laughs> oh, please. You're the coolest dad. How could I be bummed? Excuse me. <laughs> Where's my regular, emotionless son? <laughs> I appreciate it. Think we can hang out for five days without killing each other? Hell yeah. Haven't done that since I was a kid. Miss it. So do I. Been too long since we went padre y hijo against the road. <laughs> Way too long. I love road trips. Good to hear. <laughs> By the way, boy talk. What's going on with that gin, huh? <laughs> uh, not much to talk about. Don't want to talk about it. It's going okay. You know. Going okay, I guess. That was like pulling teeth. Well, I've got a week to find out the truth. I kind of miss her. There we go. It's just... I don't get to see her too much. Kind of miss
miss you. Oh, you're hooked, my son. Don't worry. This is how it goes. Ah, could that be Daniel? Hola. Hello. Everything okay, Lila? Oh, Daniel better not be giving you any sass. He's driving real slow and safe, like a grandma. Thanks for checking <laughs> in. We'll buzz you when we hit the motel. Lila, you ready? Sounds good. And Sean, gentle, say hi. Girl <laughs> cannot wait to see you again. Jen says hi. Sounds pretty good, Sean. You think? Maybe. Seriously, though, how are you really doing? I there you it's go. Too great, but I miss you. I miss you too, my son. But this is all part of growing up. I know. I don't like it. I have total faith in you, Sean. You're a Diaz. You were born to roam and find your way home. God. I love you, Dad. Oh. Wish I would have told you more. You didn't have to tell me. You showed me. Oh. By the way. Oh. Hey, wake up. Huh? huh? What? Oh, oh no. What the fuck are you doing on our property? Huh? Oh man, I crashed hard. Oh yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? A fucking kid. Get out. Nope, I'm leaving. Look, I'm leaving, okay? Uh, no, you ain't. Step out, or I'll call the cops. You don't want that boy. I don't know. Should I come out, or should I? I said out. <clears throat> we don't need cops to deal with assholes like you anyway. Listen, I don't want any trouble. Too late for that, boy. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. I just got lost, man. I wasn't sure where I was, so I pulled over. I swear, I had no idea this was your property. There's a fucking sign. Didn't you see it? I, I have one eye. Was Come too on. Exhausted. I guess I missed it. He's just a kid, and he's hurt. Look. Yeah? What happened to your eye? An accident. I'm not, I'm not going to start a fight here. into an accident. Oh, yeah? Uh-huh. Move it. <sighs> Please. I just want to go. Ho-ho. Oh, what's this? Drugs? Yeah, for my eye. Oh, yeah. Did you steal them? Like this car? Listen, it's not what you think. Oh, I think it is. You ain't the first beaner we caught. Take his backpack. Dude, come on. Get it. Let's see what he's holding. Dang it. So, nothing good. Any money? Fucking toys, man. You still play with toys? Seriously? It belongs to my brother. Leave it alone. Oh, I have a decision to make. Take it back or do nothing. Listen, I'm in this game. When we played this game in the beginning, and we went into chapter three, I said we're not holding back. We're not holding back. I am not doing nothing today. We are going to take it back. That is what we're going to do. I'm not even going to think twice about it. Come on. Here we go. Take it back. Whoa, you did not. Hey, look, we get. Get up. 
That's the first time I saw both wolves light up. Okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Let him go. God nothing. Hey. Hold on a sec, Mike. You speak Spanish, Pedro? Huh? What? 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 Hablas Espanol. Chad. So, Professor, how do you say, I'm a dirty thief? Nope, don't say it. Don't do this. Oh, you don't want to share your language? <laughs> okay. Maybe you know this one. Uh, I'm a dirty thief with one eye. <laughs> All I want to do is learn... Oh, dang, I should have said the second one. Might be our official language someday, right? One more lesson. How do you say this is not my country? Fuck off. That's how you do this it. This is country. Woohoo! Did you hear that? Look, Chad, it's gonna rain. Let's go before we get soaked. No, we took the country back. Hold on. This little thief is fucking with you. You're really pissing me off, you know that? But I'm willing to give you one last chance to make it. Nope. Right. Nope. Not stay so not letting so this bully get away with it. Just pass the audition and you're free. We'll be very upset if you refuse. I'm not your puppet. I'm not singing. We're not singing. No. I'm not gonna sing. Holy cow, what are you doing? Listen, you little beaner. Get your shit and go. Now. Look, just drive straight and we'll hit the highway. Forget this happened, man, okay? No, oh, dang it, we're going to run out of gas. Well, with that cliffhanger, we're going to leave it there. Oh, my goodness. I'm trying to... Shoulder. Yep. That has to be it for us today. Oh my goodness. Uh, oh, 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 there we go. Well, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I'll be back here again tomorrow. We will play this game some more tomorrow we will continue with this game tomorrow so uh, just hang in there with me we'll do this and we'll continue see what happens next this i love this series life is strange 2 in general is a lot of fun um so this is um i'm excited to see what happens next oh my goodness i don't i don't know what, what's gonna happen next but uh just a reminder that uh I, I don't know how many um we need to add money how what 
I, I didn't pick a thing to count for money. Oh well, we'll make up. For, we'll, we'll think of something for tomorrow. Uh, other than that, remember to share the hashtag BTS Power Up. Get people coming. Tell people about this. Have them subscribed. Did we get any new subscribers? Let's see. I have seven likes. So that's a dollar seventy-five. Let me see if we have any new subscribers. No new subscribers. So I will add a dollar seventy-five to the stream. That will put our grand total so far at. Seven hundred fifty-four dollars and thirteen cents. That is how much we've collected so far for donors choose. So be back again tomorrow so we can continue to raise funds. Get the word out. Let's make it to three hundred. Let's make it to three hundred subscribers on YouTube. That would be amazing. I would love that so much. And I know teachers would love the money that comes with it. So uh, with all that being said, have a wonderful night. Um, if you if you're already in school like some of you are, have a good Friday tomorrow. Finish off the week strong. Come back here. Let's play some more games and uh, have some fun. Until then, remember go out there in school and wherever you go. Be kind. Be true to yourself and be stellar. And I will see you next time.